You're going to set my house on fire. You're, oh, on my last nerve is what you are. Yeah. Creepy. Century ghost and dead, but thank you. This guy does not give up. Why is the principal calling Jamie? All right, we are back for one more episode tonight, and then it'll be too late to record anyway, and I've got a bunch of videos that need to be edited. So I was going to give Jamie, um, uh, I was going to swap Violet and Jamie's rooms because Violet turned out to be more of an animal lover than Jamie. But I decided to keep this room for Jamie. Maybe as a kid he was, like, into animals. But, like, once he's older, he's not so much into animals. Also, what I wanted to do for Violet fell through. So I wanted to do a galaxy room for Violet to honor her alien side. And then I was going to make her really into science and really into her alien culture. And then I was going to have her father, like, take her to six them and everything like that. Um, but to get there is a long freaking process with that damn rocket ship. I've tested it in a different file and it just took so long. wasn't even worth it. And I couldn't find any nice galaxy wallpaper either. So, I just kept her as the princess of the family. So here is her room. Oh shoot, I forgot to switch out the nightlight for uh, mon no monster light. Honestly, the reason I didn't swap their rooms is because I was just too lazy to redecorate this one for Jamie. I don't know how the volume is with these headphones. I barely tested it. So. Hopefully this isn't too loud. Okay. I guess we'll find out. It's my first time using headphones. They're $8 headphones from the dollar store. But I keep seeing all these other gamers wear headphones. I don't know what they're for. But I figured I'd, I don't know, join in on the trend. Alright, so. This is Violet's room. I didn't really change anything in here. I gave Chloe's dollhouse to her now that Chloe's too old to play with it. Um, and then I put her little rabbit toy over here. That's pretty much all I did with this room. Oh, I should probably have changed out the backpack, but whatever. And then I gave her the telescope because, like, I could keep some of her interest in her alien culture. Like, she could still like science and do all of that. I just can't do the galaxy part I wanted to do for her room. And I'm not going to take her to 6M. Maybe I will cheat um, Mason's handiness skill and take her to that little secret location that's somewhere in Oasis Springs. Um, it looks like 6M to me. Like, it looks pretty much the same, so... But yeah, this is Violet's room, and moving on, whoops, I didn't, sorry, I still don't have a mouse, I didn't do much to Noah's room, this is it, the only thing I really changed was this, I gave him the little gamer setup thing that I had, and put some binders instead of that little toy thing that he had on there. That's pretty much it. That's all I did. And then here is Chloe's room. So I changed the wallpaper finally, but I still wanted to keep some girliness in here. So I gave her some like teenage girl stuff, perfume, jewelry, like the hairdryer thing. Um, Yes, I know this is all floating, but if I had down, if I had put it down any more, then it would have been in the dresser, so. But the 
hairbrush is really floating. Oh well. And I just gave her this bed. I got rid of the bed post because I wanted to give her a big bed and it didn't work with a bed post with the bed uh, posts. And I felt maybe she was too old for them anyway. So here I gave her a little evil because she still does like art. So I gave her that and then I moved her desk over here where her dollhouse used to be and got rid of all the toys that was around it. And I changed like the binder and like the book over there. I figured, oh, I didn't realize it said that on the binder and had a skull. Oh well. And took out the K drawing for a more grown up drawing. So yeah. And I put her ballerina back in this corner. I suppose I would prefer that to be turned around. And if you're wondering why there's no music when I go in build mode, it's because I turned it off. One, I find the music during the load up screen and build mode and edit town super annoying. Um, and I have another file where I'm constantly going through loading screens and create a sim and build mode and I got sick of hearing the music. So I turned it off. Also, for some reason, it keeps malfunctioning where it will play like the loading screen music in live mode. So I can kind of turn it off for that too. So I just keep it off now. I gave her a little treadmill over here along with, and just kept her dresser. This is where her desk used to be. Whoops. Okay, well, I don't really care to fix that. But. Oh. I don't know why. This part won't. Oh. Anyway. So, yeah, those are the updated rooms. I have no idea what I'm going to do for Jamie when he grows up because this is way too immature for a teenager. I have no idea what I'm going to do for him. I have no idea what he's going to be into. I just really don't know with this kid. I still feel like he's. Like, really sweet, but I just don't understand. I don't know. I don't feel anything from him. Like, I felt maybe animals, because to me he's really sweet and kind, but he has no interest in them. He never spends time with the dog. He never spends time with Lavender. When we took him to the vet, he was more interested in cleaning up after the dogs than he was, like, interacting with the animals. He didn't even want to stay in the room with his own dog was getting checked out. So obviously he's not really that into animals or veterinary or the veterinary career. So I just don't know what this kid. I feel like he's just going to be another boring like family guy, you know, like works the nine to five, come home, kisses the wife, hugs the kid, tucks him into bed, like that kind of guy, you know. I feel like that's it. I don't feel like there's anything really that special about him. And that's fine. If that's the life that you want, that's the life I want. And I would love to have a guy like that. But, like, everyone else has their own thing going on. And Jamie just doesn't have anything going on for him. Like, he doesn't care about anything. I just don't get any vibes from this kid. So. Let's start the day. <laughs> so in this episode, I really just want to finish off Danica's skills. We don't have any birthdays or anything coming up. We do have Harvest Fest coming up, but that won't be in this episode. That will be in the next episode. So. Stop that. Oh, this dog. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you need to take care of your garden. Could you do that for me, please? Thanks. I really don't know how the sound's gonna be. I guess we'll find out. I'm gonna upload it even if it's back, so I don't want stuff missing. 
you know, if I get a lot done in this episode, I don't really want that missing. So I'll upload it no matter what, but I'm curious to see how the sounds is going to be with these. Yes. Noah has acquired a video gaming skill. Good, good, good. He does need to uh, complete that skill. Thanks, Noah, for that. So, I will tell you a little bit about Noah. Now that he's a teenager, he can actually start doing a lot of this stuff. The thing is with Noah, I feel like kids and romance is not really on his radar so i don't want to rush all this the skills stuff as a teenager because i feel like he would spend most of his adulthood young adulthood like perfecting his gaming skill and all of that and then by chance meets this girl because here's what i'm thinking he by chance meets this girl at the geek con and they have a night together, and she finds out she's pregnant, and he's like, well, I'm not, you know, I, he, and he's like, well, I'm going to step up, and I'm going to help take care of this kid. It's not really my thing. I'm not really the fatherly type, but, you know, we can do, like, you can drop him off on the weekends, or we can, like, rotate weeks or whatever. We're going to make this work. But, like, he's not really into the family life, so he's not really thinking, oh, well, I'm going to marry you. He's more like, yeah, you can, like, drop the kid off at my place. I'll spend time with it and be a father, but uh, not really into the whole family thing, you know? So I feel like with Noah, I don't want him to have a kid right away. I don't want that. I want him to just spend... I'm thinking I won't even have him have his kid until he's an adult. So, because he doesn't even leave the house very often, you know, so, so I don't want to do anything with him as a teenager. Obviously, I'm not going to stop him from playing his video games because that's his character. Um, so he might like finish that before he's an adult, but I'm not going to try to do anything with Noah until he's an adult, a young adult. We are still very much no, into... We are still very much into Danica anyway. So he's probably gonna like complete his video gaming skill by the time he's a young adult. Which is fine. I mean maybe yeah, maybe he did spend a lot of time playing video games as a teen I did, so like yeah, that could totally be. Damn bad so Room for more like rock. Uh isn't Jamie supposed to be at Jamie? You're supposed to be at school. Go on. The other ones are allowed to be home because they just aged up. But you're you're supposed to be in school, so goodbye. Okay. Do you do what you were told? Probably not, because why would you? Okay, you did. You need to go work on your baking. You have time to do like one thing of baking. So go make a chocolate souffle. Yes. Chloe has acquired the fitness skill. And I might have started storylines for the other kids, but I'm not playing them. Once they're young adults, they're out of the house. I'm not playing them. I might check in with them once in a while, and I'll definitely keep relationships up with Noah. He'll like visit them and talk to them and stuff, but they I won't be playing them. So, I might start a storyline with them now, but once they're adults, they, I'm not playing them so they could do whatever they want. Okay, work for Danica starts in about an hour. What I mean is, like, I'm not gonna go and manage their lives. I'm not. Chloe acquired the writing skill. Hmm. Alright, I didn't know she was in the writing. Okay. The writing skill. For what? Say yes, Norb. For what? She wasn't even doing anything. Whatever. Stop! Why do you keep? 
You have to stop abandoning food in your oven. You're going to set my house on fire. She keeps leaving it to go do mixology, so you know what? Unless it's a party, there will be no mixology table in this house. What do you want, Cat? Come here. Come here. Well, did you want something? Come here. No, fine. Why were you looking at me? Go to work! Oh my gosh, you're so late. You're like half an hour late, like 15 minutes late. What are you doing? You're, oh, on my last nerve is what you are. Oh. Um, oh. Big Goose Ghost just congratulated Dude, Chloe on her so, birthday. So That's so sweet. <laughs> Creepy. It's a Jerry Ghost and dead, but thank you. Jamie is done for school, a school for the day, so doing satisfactory work, but his teacher thinks he could be doing better. Go ahead and start your homework, young Jamie. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Promotion or no promotion? Why are you not home? Oh my god, there's still an hour. Alright, promotion, truth. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Promotion or no promotion? <sighs> she got it! Yes. She got her promotion. Promoted to Sue. Sue Chef. Danica has been promoted. She will now make an additional $27 per hour. For a grand total of 131 per hour, she has all received. She has also received the following bonus: 1,306 dollars, an ice ice box of steel, hey, and a write cookbook on the computer. Her next shift is Monday at 8 p.m. Wait, she's working tonight, but she just got home. When's she supposed to spend time with her kids? Oh, she's going to be getting home at 2 a.m. She's going to be so tired. Oh, I'm going to hate that. Oh, well. She has everything she needs for the next promotion. But, I mean, she's not going to get another promotion tonight. Oh, no, she doesn't have everything. She needs to prepare food. Well, that's not going to happen. What you are going to do, though, is go cook your kids' dinner. We still need to work on our gourmet. So, we'll make whatever this is. Go on, then. You don't have much time if you want to spend any time with your children at all. Shoot. Noah! Huh? <laughs> Clean that up. Oh! Uh -huh. Nobody better have been drinking that. Okay. Oh my god. I thought when Baco died, he wouldn't be calling anymore. He just called again and go to the damn festival. This guy does not give up! All right, we need one of the kids to get an A in high school to complete her thing, so you need to go do your homework. And then you're going to have a school, I'm going to give you a school project to complete. Okay, recommended for children, recommended for teens, 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 children, okay. You can do this one. I'll let you eat after you finish your homework, but I need you to get an A in school. Your C, that's not good. 
Right, okay, you finished cooking? Ooh, Andy. This is what you've decided to serve your family? Put the brownies down. Yeah, Danica, you're gonna need to pee before you go to work. Wait. Can I get you to make something? Will that count as cooking? Go make that. And you can be at work. Um, sure, Luna, but I mean, it's like 8 o'clock. Man, Danica's not even going to be home. Hi, Luna. Come on in. Okay. Do not be late for work. Now I have to reach video gaming with me. <laughs> Alright. Yes. Then our bed. <laughs> Shazzle. <laughs> Leave it. Go to work. Go to work. Yeah, 75% done. I couldn't do better than that. I just put up everyone's needs because, like, Chloe didn't go to bed until three. This stupid school project took forever. Yeah, she's really feeling the loss of Baco today. Okay. Come do something to cheer yourself up. Clean the counter and make a chocolate souffle. Then you're going to take care of your garden, and then you're going to read about gardening, and then you're going to do some more baking. Then you're going to make supper, and then you're going to head off to work. Okay, what are you doing? You're going to chat with Chloe. You're up here video gaming. Yeah, there's no way he's gonna make it to adulthood without mastering that video so. game skill. Gag gag! Gatsu! Yakinar! I don't know what happened uh -huh. here. Kumba. And you're just staying on the top of the stairs. I think I wanna get her a different bed. I think the princess of the family would definitely have a big bed. Ooh, you're mala. Jamie's going on a field trip. Okay. <laughs> For now. All the kids will be heading off to school soon. I need everyone in there every day. Uniform. Your book. And you're going to come deal with this. Stop complaining and just go read, okay? D 
Why are you not doing what you're told? And what is wrong with the dog? Where are you going? No, leave her alone. Shouldn't you be heading off to work? Oh, no. She's just going to be doing this Grants. for a while. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yips. You boy oh, and the <laughs> Storm of flame. This is so boring. But she needs to do these rare plants and the cow plant and it's just like not happening because she's taking so long to do this stupid gardening skill. How's she doing in her other skills? Baking is almost completed. Gourmet cooking halfway completed. Halfway through the last level. About halfway. Okay, put it down. You need to do some baking now. You need to prepare food to get your daily tasks done. You are really <laughs> boring me right now. Uh -huh. Chloe has returned home with a school assignment to complete. She must work on practicing lines using the mirror, practice singing, acting, or using the puppet theater for the part in the school production. Completing this assignment by the next school day will grant school progress. Okay. We could totally do that. But first, you need to do your homework. Why is it not letting me do your homework? Where are you? You're not getting out of this. Why can't she do her stupid homework? He can do his. That is so so annoying! She needs to get a stupid A! The only thing I got was to sell her homework and buy a new one. Which I doubt since her brother's homework didn't work either. Yeah, it's not working. <sighs> Every episode, this game finds a new way to frustrate me.
It says homework not started, so I don't understand why it's not letting her do her freaking homework. Oh my god, this game annoys the fun shit out of me. Not getting any stupid answers. <sighs> Why must you piss me off? Just one episode. I'd like one episode where everything goes right. I'm gonna stop playing this stupid game. Fantastic! I can try one more thing, which is to go out of the household and go back in, but... Just one episode. Everything goes right. First episode, she set her house on fire. <laughs> Get out! Second episode! Second episode was fine. Nothing happened, I suppose. Third episode. Dawn rejected us. Put the new what you can say? <laughs> Sweebs. He said no! Oh, snurb. Fourth episode, we found out the man we were marrying is an alien. First of all, I want to change his hair. I'm sorry. If anyone's a good deed. Hmm. Fifth episode, nothing really happened except the fact that I was exhausted. Sixth episode, just one thing after another. Everything is just pissing me off today. Of course you broke something. Jeez, Noah, you are such a fussy baby. My gosh. Because I'm not dealing with a with a fucked up schedule. I'm not dealing with this shit. You are never welcome here again. Hey! You do not just go in my fridge and start eating my food. Not your baby, not your problem. We have to kill the land grab, that's all. Feed the baby! Seventh episode. Ooh, that one was my favorite. Favorites with the toddler bed fiasco. I don't understand why you can't go in that fucking corner. You know what? If I move this bed and you're able to walk into that corner, I am going to be very mad. So what was your problem? Oh, but the ninth episode at the end when I just wanted to get a nice family picture. No. Forget it! Forget it! Not worth it! I'm going to rip out all my fucking hair. It's just not worth it. This game is so frustrating! Eleventh episode, which was this last... Uh, tenth episode, which was last episode. It was still this uh, family picture at the beginning of the episode, but I didn't get any of that on camera. So, like... We've had, like, two okay episodes. Out of eleven. Ten. Out of, no, yeah. Ah. The thing is, the point is, since it's a very frustrating game, 
And I'm not sure I want to play anymore at this particular moment because she needs to get an A in school so her mom can finish her aspiration. And she's decided to be the only person in the house who can't do their goddamn homework. Now, I could go with Noah because we're both at the same level. But the thing is, I don't want to do it with Noah because Noah doesn't really seem like the type of kid that would give a shit about his homework. And I can't do it with Jamie or Violet because, one, they're not home yet. And, two, it has to be a high school student. Which means it has to be one of the teenagers. <sighs> oh, I guess it's gonna have to be Noah. I guess it'll stop him from that video gaming skill, though. I don't think I can actually do all that. Just go do it. <laughs> Put in a bit. You go practice. How? Fine, and you can go do another school activity. And hopefully that will get you some extra credit. Hopefully, even though you can't do your fucking homework anymore, you'll still get an A student. Can you? No, you have to come down and cook dinner soon. Luna you won't have time to do any baking before school. Violet has returned to school with the project. I don't care. <laughs> Who's calling Jamie? The principal? Why is the principal calling Jamie? Horsa, be Ha. The principal called to say that my school performance is pretty shaky. If I'm not careful, I could drop a grade. Dude, he's been in school for one day. What did you expect? He was going to show up as Einstein? Fine. We'll get him a project to do because I can't have that. I can't have my kids failing school. I'm supposed to be a good mother. So... Go do this, whatever it is. Whoa. If I have someone help Chloe do this, will she do it faster? So she's not up in the middle of the night? Put that down. You're not eating a muffin for supper going to lose my mind with these children. Put it down. You're not having a muffin for supper. You're going to make me unable to play this game tonight because I'm going to wake up all my damn neighbors because you guys are just fucking pissing me off. Go make some food. Is she cooking with me? Is she gonna be a cook like her mother? Put it back! From now on, we are not keeping any desserts in this house.
You will wait until your mother <laughs> has finished cooking for you, you rude, <laughs> no rude day. Sims. Oh, Chucha. Eat that and you die. Pator, Dobby. Pondo lives by the yen. Grinza. <laughs> For now. Stop talking with your husband and just cook <laughs> the meal. Avuda, <sighs> Polkum. Everything oh, in this game please. is so slow. That's it. No more fridge. Okay, she has just maxed out the gourmet cooking skill. Whipney, Axum. No, I don't want to play anymore. Because they're pissing me off.